Hey besties, welcome back. So as you can tell by the title, we have a review on Sneaky Bonds. Now, I just have to say, I bought this because I love Amber Rose and I saw her video on it and then all the other girls started doing it. And you know what? It's a great concept. Whoever invented this is a freaking genius. Yeah. But I love it. It looks so amazing on it. It works really good. And it does, Teresa's gonna do the demonstration to show you guys yeah. how it works. The only problem we've encountered with it is that this is after hours of use. Yes. And it's in and summertime. Summer. Yeah. So after you start to sweat, it starts to move because it's an adhesive so it sticks to you. Yeah. It so, starts to melt off literally after your skin. And you have to continue to adjust it and fix it and that was such a pain in the butt for me and I cannot stand that. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna keep in mind that he has it on right now and just try it in the winter to see if I still have that problem. But I'm gonna give you guys the black one. That's what we're gonna give away and you guys can tell us if you like it or not and whatnot and you can have it. Girlfriend of ours actually requested this video so that's yeah. why we're making it because she's like, I want to buy that bra but I'm not sure if I should get it or not. Can you guys do a review on it? So I also think it works better for bigger breasted. I think and it's good for fake boobs. Yeah. I feel like for me what I would love for them to fix is I would love for them to add like a more stiffer cup to make it look like I have yeah because it's boobs. just on the side it kind of presses it in a little bit once they pull the string down to it give you the it cleavage. In. I want it to also give me some volume here like I because I have volume but it's kind of squishing it in. Yeah. So that's the only thing I would say is if they just do like a stiff cup so it makes it look like I don't just have cleavage but I have something to like I don't know just more shape. I think for the girls with enhanced breasts with breast implants it will look amazing yes it's perfect if, yeah if, like for example you and if it doesn't wet off you either Mm -hmm. the way it did for us after wearing it for a long time. For example, if you have like breasts that have been done a little too separate, yeah. you know, too much space and you want to create that closer space. Because I know some girls get their breasts done on purpose closer like this. Yeah. But they'll look funny when you take your clothes off and they're like, Yeah, yeah. it's like, so I don't know, but it puts each their own, you know what I'm saying? I'm just yeah, saying like, like me that. personally, because some people like that. So it's not about what I like for that person, what that person likes for them. With that said, I don't know, maybe in the winter time it won't melt off us, but honestly we're in the house with AC and I feel like the adhesive and just my natural body heat is already I can tell it's just slipping. It doesn't it's hold. It's not slipping right now, but I can tell it it's will. heating it up and it will. It will. It exactly. starts to like slip. It was so embarrassing. I was like, oh my God, I have to sit here and like, I'm like this, like fixing myself. It's so bad. <laughs> so, and then like, I wasn't really, I kind of threw it on. So as you guys can see, it's a little more to you the left. You have to really aim it yeah. perfectly. Yeah. That's the other thing. So, cause I look it's like so far to the left. That's the only thing if it was just a little bit to the But It's sticking really good. It's it just does. your body heat will eventually make it and slide off these, and stick. You do have to wash it after every use. And then they, it comes with the wrapping that you put over it, the paper. Yo, so after you wash see. it, you lay it out to dry to flat. Dry. And then you have to put it back in and then you put it back in this packaging. Yeah. That's it. Just make sure all the water is dried off before you put the plastic on there. Yes, you have to do that for sure. I can't remember how many uses can you get out of this. A lot. It, it'll it'll go, right? As long as you take care of it and you wash it. I don't know the exact number. I don't think they even gave that actually. I mean, this thing is kind of pricey. It's like forty-five. Because I know they have the panties. Like bucks. Justin and I bought the panties, and I have. We'll have the link down below for you guys yeah. for this product. And as well, we have like panties with the same kind of concept. Concepts. And they have the adhesive, so it's, it's like fixed. Like if you don't want it to show, it's yeah. It dresses. has no lines. It'll just stick here in the front and mm -hmm. in the back. Yeah, they're super cute, and they, they, they work great for dresses that are kind of like instead of going commando. Yeah. Okay, you guys, so here is me basically putting the bra on. First of all, I put it down too low, I think. I think it needs to go up a little bit higher. Yeah, as you can see on the right-hand side, right-hand side from your view where my tattoo is, it's like way too low. And I think it might be a size too small. So I think instead of a C, I need a D because I think this is a C cup. I can't remember exactly. So anyways, this is me tightening it fully. And I'm going to show you what it looks like with the green dress that I was wearing earlier or that I am wearing in this video. But see how I just have it way too low. I I made the mistake because I kind of rushed putting it on. So number one, you need to put it a little bit higher. And number two, you have to make sure that you get the correct cup size. Now, I was telling you guys that I wish the cups were just firmer, not so loose, so that it gives me more of a shape. I feel like this bra is perfect for girls who have breast implants because the breast implant already creates a shape. So all you have to do is just slap the bra on, covers your nipples, and it just pulls the boobs together, which is perfect and makes your clothes look amazing. So now I'm going to show you how it looks with a dress on and I'm going to show you the three different settings you can use. So here I'm going to pull it apart and this is if you just want to slap it on and cover your nipples and you don't want to create any cleavage. You just want to have a natural falling boob. Now however you can see I did not tape it on evenly so you can see a part of the bra in there but you should not be able to see the part of the bra like you can on me right now. But like I said I did not take my time which I wish I would have done instead of rushing. Now I'm going to take my dress down and I am going to tighten it halfway to give you kind of a halfway cleavage but not 
not a full pull together cleavage. And then I'm gonna put the dress back on and this is what it looks like when you pull the strings halfway. It gives you cleavage, it pulls them a little more together and it still gives you that natural flow, but it's not where they're like, boom, you know, smashed in together. And that's what you have there. Next, I'm gonna take the dress off and then I'm gonna show you what it is with the full setting of the tightening. And that is going to fully pull it in like massively. You see how they're like crushed together and they're practically glued to each other. So this is gonna give you some massive cleavage, but it's not really pulling my boobs up. Like I said, maybe if I had taped them up a little bit higher, then it would have looked differently. It's, the bra is just way too low. Like look, it's attached to practically my stomach. So, but still you could see how much cleavage is creating for you. But with that said, even if you're having a dodo bird day and you decide to tape your bra halfway down your stomach, it still is gonna create a cleavage for you. And with this dress, it's really low. So I feel like had I taped the bra a little bit higher, it might've stuck out even more like you can see on the left hand side as you're looking at the screen but I still like it I have to tell you I like it better than the pasties I feel like it can be improved but it'll do for now so anyways we really hope you guys like this review we know you're gonna love this giveaway I mean yeah. who doesn't we saw it we're like oh my god just bought two I said. She didn't buy one just to try it first to see if she's no, gonna like I it. need a black one and because I thought it was all this hype I'm like oh it's gonna be awesome but yeah, yeah. whatever <laughs> that said I am gonna purchase this product because I don't have it but I've been using dresses just to try it out and I'm gonna purchase it you know why because I have a lot of stuff like for example this dress that I don't want my nipples showing through so even just for not the cleavage just the fact that it will cover my nipples I love that you know so it's not like I had that problem the other day we went out to dinner one of the dresses that I wanted to wear I couldn't wear it because you can see my nipple through it was white tape two works for that no but this is nice I love this I really yeah. like it okay as long as it doesn't slip and slide around okay <laughs> I actually really like it so I don't know what we say is it a yay or a nay um for me I said I have to try it in the winter still because I've only tried it in the summer if it wasn't for the fact that it slips off of me I'm gonna let you guys know how I feel after it's pulled out and I wear it out yeah but so for, so the, for me for now, summer absolutely not absolutely no. not right but for winter I don't know yet right yeah Teresa just so I would say it's a nay because it slips off, but I'm still gonna go with it because I like it. I like the fact that I can put it on and cover my nipples without using pasties. Yeah, because you can still see the pasty. Like I've tried that and you can still see the pasties. Yeah. I'm not gonna wear that. Yeah. And then I end up wearing a, the bra that goes around like this, but you mm -hmm. can still see it like, so I don't know, for me it's a win guys. Even with the little negative that the slide on. Well, you guys are gonna get this one. So there's a link in the description bar. And Come this way, because now you're to the right, to the right. So you guys have to let us know if you like it. With that said, don't, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you like this review and you like this video and me being practically naked on camera for you guys. <laughs> Embarrassing. Okay, not really. But anyways, give this video a Better hair than me. <laughs> Comment down below. We can't wait to hear back from you. And don't forget the link is down below for you guys to enter twin. Otherwise, Justin and I will definitely see you in our next video. Bye. Bye.